Hey, tell that y'all family at this time. May the peace of y'all come upon you when you learn to obey him. I have this very important video to do the prophet vision, the prophet's vision. Yes, the old the prophets of old, brothers and sisters, dealing with the Greek enslavement. But before I get into it, I am compelled to um, bring you something from Isaiah chapter 66, verse 1. I'm see how far I'm going to this. Uh, I don't know at this moment where I'm going to stop, what verse I'm going to stop at. But I'm, I'm going to read this information because it's very important. Because y'all was showing these people something right here. In the book of Isaiah, y'all right here, brothers and sisters, verse 60, chapter 66, verse 1. It says, Heaven is my throne, and the earth is my footstool. What temple can you build for me as great as debt? They got good as debt. See, but that's not saying, so keep in mind, brother, because some people will uh, insinuate this or say this, that y'all is not required for us to build him a temple. Y'all didn't say that. He was just, just saying what temple is great as his place in heaven where he resides. But when you go and read Isaiah, not Isaiah, Ezekiel chapter 42, um, chapter 40. For you will see, y'all said he coming down to dwell with us on earth. And he gave instructions for us to build a third temple, brothers and sisters, once we return home. But we have to do the things y'all tell us to do. We must obey him. We must gather together. So let's read this right here. Let's continue to read this real quick. So, um... What temple can you build for me as good as this? I'm going to read a words as that. My hand has made both the earth and skies. I'm seeking I turn off the light and stop all this. Um, it's, it's, it's interfering with my focus. So give me a moment, brothers and sisters. If I could turn this light off real quick. Here, I'm trying to turn this light off. It won't let me. So, okay, I'm, let me continue. Here. It's right here, brothers and sisters. Um, excuse me. It's saying they are mine. Yet I will look with pity on a man who has humble, who has a humble and a contrite heart. This is referring to a man or a woman, brothers and sisters, who trembles at my word. See, it's very important that we trembles. We regard you words, we respect his words. And fear his words. To take it as true and respect his words, brothers and sisters. To move to action, to obey. That's what he's saying right there. But those who choose their own way, see, see, take this to heart. If you choose a way not as of not as of Yah, you take any other philosophy, any other knowledges, your own knowledge. And try to go around the yacht thinking you're going to save your people. You're going to free your people according to your way. I, I hear brothers say that. Brothers come to my inbox and want me to follow their way. But I reject their way. I'm only going to go y'all way what I see that is already written from the words of the prophet. They gave us the vision of old. What y'all told them that many in our people of our nation reject. That's why we're in captivity today. Only way to stop that. And reverse that is to obey Yah. I see this. I know this plain. That's why I can't go no other brother's way. It's only Yah way I'm going to follow. Any other way will get you killed. You see that. Martin Luther King tried it. Malcolm X uh, tried it. Many others are um, going down that same road and going to go to their death. In many different ways, brother and sister, it's going to lead to them to their, to their impoverishment. That's why Father said in the wilderness, many rebels will be found dead. And got rid of. People don't believe it. But I see it. Because people walking in their own way. That y'all tell us not to right here. It's the every detailed word of y'all. We must follow. Let me get my place. Give me a moment. I lost my place. Right here. Verse 3. But those who choose their own way. See you have a choice. 
to choose Yahweh. Each and every individual have a choice. Man and woman have a choice to choose Yahweh or their own way. But those who choose their own ways delight in their sin. See, you delight in your sin. See, it's a sin or curse. See, you're cursed. You choose on people is rejecting the Messiah. Yah appoints to gather his people. They tell you out. They know they're not the Messiah, the branch of Yahweh. The but they saying they gathering y'all people and gonna lead many astray. That's why people tell you, oh, many people have been many gatherings, yes, but not the one appointed. They're gonna gather the twelve tribes, brothers and sisters. A lot of people don't get that in the past. It doesn't matter, Ben I mean or whoever. It doesn't matter if they not y'all see debt found in. Yerim Yah, they call Jeremiah chapter 23, verse 6, is a fraud. And like the knowledge of Yah, that's plain and simple as that. It's in the writings. Everything must be carried out according if you want to be blessed by Yah family. That's why I'm going over these scriptures with you. You must learn them. You must follow them in detail. And hear the words of Yah. Every bean, every tree is not a righteous tree. Some people mean well, but they like the knowledge of Yah. Everything must be done in detail if you want to be blessed and protected by Yah. It's very important, brothers and sisters, what I'm covering with you now. Give me a moment, right here. So you see, but those who choose their own ways delight in their sin, and their sins are cursed. It said Barah, they got God, but Barah, the creator will not accept their offering. See, it's going to be an offering made. Y'all not going to accept your offerings, brothers and sisters. When such men sacrifice, we just slaughter an ox on the altar of Barah. It is no more acceptable to him than a human sacrifice. That's what Jesus read this, see. A human sacrifice or offering. Y'all never permitted and allow a human sacrifice or offering. For our sins, he put it out right there to you, brother and sister, if you can see that. See, if they offer the slaughter, which is slaughter a lamb, they got sacrifice, which is the, um, kill a lamb, or bring a, or bring a offering of grain, it is a loathsome to Barah as putting a dog or blood of, of, of a swine on his altar. See that? See, it's dishonorable. When somebody walking their own way. See, that's what got to put out in the land. This y'all showing them a dick. By uh, the priest allowed and accepted the foul offerings, which uh, made the, uh, the slaughter place, the altar, defiled with the temple and the people. You see? These are things you must know our past history, bro. I'm covering it with your name. It says, when they burn incense to him, he count it. The same as, as they bless a idol. See that? I will send great trouble upon them. See that what y'all said? See, these was the promises of y'all. The sanctions, the judgments of y'all. On our people for doing these horrible things against y'all. It's all the things they feared for when I called them. They refused to answer. And when I spoke to them, they were not here. Instead, they did wrong before my eyes. You see that? And chose what they knew. I despise. Y'all hate it. See? Our ancestors did these things, brother, sister. The leaders of our nation. The priests. The prophets. The king. The Messiah of them days worked evil against Yah. See, these are the things we got to know. They weren't pleasing to. They despise Yah. He said, hear the words of Barah, the creator, all you who fear him, see, and tremble at his words, see. Your brother, excuse me, your brother hate you and cast you out for being loyal to my name. You see that? Y'all was informing them of these things and, and, and said, honor, they got glory to Barah, 
they scuff. See, they and said be happy in in y'all and said be one be glad in y'all, but they shall be put to shame. What is all this commotion in the city? What is a terrible noise from the temple? See, it is the voice of Yah taking revenge upon his enemies. See that? Even of our own nation, who has heard or seen anything as strange as this. For on one day, suddenly a nation, Yah shall yell, Yah shall be born. So keep that in mind. See, so they shall be born even before the birth pains come. See, like switching gears in a moment, just as Yasha Yoya, angry stars, the baby is born. And the nation begins. Shall I bring to the point of birth and then not deliver? As Yah, your Barah, no, never. He said, Rejoice with Yasha alone. Be glad with her. Be glad. With her, all you who love her, you who mourn for her, see, delight in Yah Shalom. They got Jerusalem, but Yah Shalom. Drink deep of her honor, even as an infant at a mother's generous breast. Prosperity shall overflow Yah Shalom like a river. He, he sends, he's showing us how we're going to be restored again. Says Yah, for I will send it the riches of the Gentile, the nations. Will flow to her. See, prosperity. Even the nations going to bring their wealth to us. Her children shall be nursed at her breast, on her hips, and dangle on her knees. I will comfort you there as a little one is comforted by its mother. See where we're going to be comforted at? in our homeland in Zion. When you see Yahshua alone, your heart will rejoice. Vigorously, it's talking about our nation. Vigorously, health will be yours. See how our well, health is going to be restored to health again in our land. All the world will see the right just hand of Yah upon his people. See, see, they're going to see the prosperous hand that come upon Yah people again. They don't see it yet, and it's wrath upon the enemy. See, it's going to turn when we get back home. Only when we get back home, the earth is going to witness these things upon us. For see, Yah will come with fire and with swift chariots of doom to pour out the fury of his anger in his hot rebuke with flames of fire. See that? For Yah will punish the world by fire and by his sword. And slain of Yah shall be many. See, but this will turn and come when we get home. Those who worship idols that are hidden behind a tree in the garden, feasting their dead on pork and on mouse and all forbidden meat, they will come to an end, says Yah. I will, I will see full well what they are doing. He said, I see full well what they are doing. I know what they are thinking, see. So I will gather together all the nations and the people against Yah Shalom, see. When we get back home, y'all gonna allow the nation to come, but that's when y'all gonna step in. See, that's gonna be the day of Yah. When we return home, brothers and sisters, set back up, and the kingdom be restored. The temple be back set up. See, they're gonna be jealous. They, they gonna, gonna come into their heart to want to come to attack us. That's when y'all gonna step in. See, these are things you got to know. So these for a lot of time, see. All nation of people against Yah Shalom. See that? Where they shall see my honor. See, say, see where they shall see Yah honor, the nation. I will perform a mighty miracle against them. I will send those who escape as missionaries to the nations to Tasha's Put, Put, Lude, Meshach, Roush, Tubal, Javan, and to the lands beyond the sea that have not heard of my fame. Seen my honor. And there they should declare my honor to the Gentiles. See that? And, should, and they shall bring back all of your brethren from every nation as a gift to Yah. So you keep that. So some of our people still left in the lands, they're going to be brought back. But after all these things take place, after Yah uh, uh, 
um, break these nations down. Gonna be some people survive, but none of them are gonna go in out and missionary and tell other people what took place over there around our land, brothers and sisters. They're gonna have people to change their heart. See, so some things people ain't gonna hear to later. What what gonna take place when we return home? So these are things you got to know. I put that there to show you that did some words of Yah to set some things in order. So right now, uh, we're going to get into the prophet book. We're switching gears once again. And we're going we're gonna to deal uh, with who enslaved us. I'm going to the prophet book so you can know. Yes, the, um, the Edomites enslaved us, but not they weren't the ones that took us. They're not European people or what they call white people that took us far away from our borders. Yes, they slaves us down into uh, Saudi Arabia. But not beyond the borders of the east, over there in the east, brothers and sisters. So we're going to see that. So let's uh, get into this right here. So you can make a uh, distinction from the Greeks, the European people, and Esau people. So right now, give me a moment. Let me get to, uh, I'm going to the prophet book, Yael, they call Joel. So let's go to the prophets, the prophet of vision, brothers and sisters. What y'all gave to the prophet, showing up to the prophet, what took place in the prophet times. These are the things we got to know. Give me a moment. I'm going to put these glasses on real quick. They read my reading. Give me a moment. Put that down for a second. I can see it a little bit better. I like to see it a little close up. I hate that I had to put these glasses on some time, time but I'm putting them on now. I, I meant to put them on, but it slipped my mind until I was turning the page and seeing them in the scriptures. So but I have them now, brothers and sisters. Okay, so that's why I can hold um, my phone cam closer to the um, um, page. Okay, give me a moment. I'm trying to get the um, chapter um, three. So I'm, I'm going to read the whole chapter three. Hope I can get all this in this video because it's very important, brother and sister, what we talked talked about and what I showed you. Brother and sister, we must learn to fear y'all and tremble at the words of y'all, brothers and sisters. We got to uh, uh, feel this in our, in our mind and our heart. That's what y'all told us. To love him. With all our heart, with all our mind, our heart, our soul and strength, that means our whole being. He leaves nothing out. When we care for Yah, concerned about the words of Yah, the ways of Yah, brothers and sisters, we'll be concerned about each and every one of Yah people. Yes, we're going to care for the nation uh, um, um, later, but they got to get their punishment, brothers and sisters, by the will of Yah. But we right now, we got to learn to care about our own nation. By no means, we not going to do no nation no harm that y'all forbid them to do harm too. We got to keep all these things to mind and take all these things to heart, brothers and sisters. We got to know what we got to carry out and, and things we don't have to carry out. These are the things we got to learn. This is how serious, brothers and sisters, the detailed plans of y'all is. These are all what each and every one of you must know to take y'all words for serious. or going to be your life. Or you're going to find yourself sinning against y'all. By walking around with a careless mind and heart. And ignorance. A lot of brothers and sisters in ignorance. That's why you see all the whoredom they do out there in the earth. As they roam each block, neighborhood, street, state, country, town. In the careless mind. I sit all day long, brothers and sisters. The careless mind the house of our people. I talk to people. All day long. I don't reveal the words of y'all because a lot of people don't want to even hear the words of y'all. They're not ready for it. They're blinded by all other falsehood. Some a lot of the kids on their own business. So right here, um, right here, we're dealing with um, um, Joel chapter um, three. I'm gonna get right into it. So at that time, so y'all, so at that time, he's showing them something in the future again. When I restore, so he said, when I restore the prosperity of Yad, I read that early. I had to get off of, um, Isaiah how he said he's gonna restore the uh, prosperity of, of Yah Shalom, which is referring to. Uh, the people of Yah, and once again, so um, she so said the prosperity of Yah and Yah Shalom. They go repeat it. Right this says, "Say of Yah, I will gather the armies of the world into the valley of." She saw it. Show you saw the detailed step what gonna take place first. We gotta uh, prosper first before ever the day of Yah come. And you see the moon. See, that's why I know not even worry about no uh, moon that look reddish right now. The red, the moon that look like the uh, like um blood. It's not time. We got to first prosper. We first got to be home. The temple got to be built. We all got to be restored again. 
It's all right here. Here, little, dead little. That's what I'm showing you, brothers and sisters. Now, to link it all together. We got to know each detail uh, 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 step we're taking. And we got to know our time per. We got to know what took place behind us. What took, what's going on in our present. And what's going to take place tomorrow. We got to know this. In order to be free, brothers and sisters. I am Yasid Dek. Your leader, brother and sister, if you know that not. Now, right now, yes, I'm at the lowest. And our nation at the lowest, but one day we're going to rise into our prosperity. Then anything's going to be real clear to you, brothers and sisters. That's a fact. You might see me now walking in my lowest esteem. Barely making it. But when the time comes on that day, I'll be shining in the will of Yah. Because we got to make Yah shine first. That's the most important, brothers and sisters. Because our people tarnish the name of Yah. They purse Yah. Our people did these things, brothers and sisters, against our mighty one. Yah. These are our facts, brothers and sisters. That's why we have the Lord's esteem now. Because we put Yah at the Lord's esteem in the eyes of all the nations of the earth. We made it seem like Yah is not capable of uh, um, protecting his people. And he only punished us to correct us. He ain't regard, he ain't care. I mean, he cared about what they name. He don't like that. But he got to correct us. And get our hearts back right with him, brothers and sisters. So we keep that in mind. We got to learn to fear him. So right here is reading him. Give my place back. It said, um, I will gather the armies of the world into the valley where Yah Judges, they got Jehovah, but it's actually Yah judges and punish them there for harming my people. You see that? The reason why he gonna gather them there for scattering my inheritance among the nations and dividing up my land. See, so we know the land we got divided by the nations, and they divide up my people as their slaves. You see that? And they traded a young lad for a prostitute and a little girl for wine enough to get drunk. Tyree and Saddam, don't you try to interfere? Are you trying to take a vengeance on me, you cities of Philistia? Beware, for I will strike back swiftly and return the harm to your heads. You have taken my silver and gold and all my precious treasures. See that? And carried them off to your heathen temples. See, the idolatrous temples. You have sold the people of Yada. So I'm trying to get this thing to focus on. Move away from that light. Or the fishy light. <coughs> Excuse me, people. You have sold the people of Yada and Yashalom to the Greeks. See that? Get that in mind. See, to the Greeks. Keep that in mind. To the Greeks. I ain't saying, you know. I'm not talking about Esau, to the Greeks, who took them far from their own land. See, the Greeks did it. Not Esau, but the Greeks, brothers and sisters, but they call Caucasians, European people. And that stock of Yafet, see now, they call Yafet. So right here, it's a, but I will bring them back again from all the places you have sold them to. See that? So you get that? And I will pay you back for all that you have done. I will sell your sons and your daughters to the people of Yad. And they will sell them to the Sabians far away. And this is a promise from Yah. See, all these things got to take place. Once this far and, and wide. Announce this, announce this far and wide. Get ready for war. Because script... Your best soldiers collect all of your armies, melt your plowshares into swords, and beat your pruning hooks into spears. Let the weak be strong. Gather together and come, all nations everywhere. You see that? And now, O oh Yah, see Yah telling them to do this thing. And now, O oh Yah, bring down your warriors, collect the nations. Bring them to the valley of Yasafat. For they will 
Excuse me, there I will set to pronounce judgment on them all. Now let the sickle do its work. The harvest is ripe and waiting. Training the wine press for to it training the wine press, for it is full and to overflowing with weak, wickedness of these men. See that? The multitudes, multitudes waiting in the valley for the verdict of their doom. For the day of Yah is near. You see that? The day of Yah is near. In the valley of judgment, the sun and the moon will be darkened. See, that's when the time the sun and the moon will be dark. That's See, we're going to be home already there and, and to be protected by Yah. So you got to know these things, brothers and sisters. Don't let people uh, play you. A lot of our brothers and sisters are going by on the New Testament, 24th chapter of Matthew. I know it very well. I've, I've been there. I've done that. I know that. Light. It said the sun and moon will be darkened and the stars will draw their light. And Yah shouts from his temple in Yah Shalom. You see that? Showing, see the temple is dead. See, you got every word is very important. Remember you said his words? You got to trim at Yah's words. We got to go back home. I'm going I'm to cover that and, and, uh, and, and the video's coming. About who's gonna build the third temple of Yah in Yah Shalom? Again, I got videos out on it, but I'm 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 gonna touch up on it. It's in Yah shouts from his temple in Yah Shalom, and the earth and sky begins to shake. Remember, I read you earlier. Y'all say he got a temple in heaven. Earth is a footstool. Now he got one in Yah Shalom. See, the third temple, and the earth and the sky begin to shake, but. To his people, see, y'all should yell, y'all. Y'all will be very gentle, see. And that day, he'll be very gentle. He is their refuge, see, and strength. Then you should know at last that I am Yah, your Barak, and Zion. You see that? The Michael Desh Mountain. Y'all should know should be mine forever. You see that? And the time will come when no foreign armies will pass through her anymore. You see that? See, he said the time coming after he lured them in our territory for that day of Yah. See, that's the day of Yah, brother. So not now while we in captivity. We got the guy and go home first. He pulling us out of the fire to bring us home. Where everything gonna take place at, brother? Sister, the ultimate battle. They gonna uh, uh, change this earth. So let me get my place to sit on. Um, Y'all should be mine forever. The time will come when no foreign armies will pass through her anymore. Sweet wine will drip from the mountains, and the hills shall flow with milk. Water will fill the dry streams beds of Yah. To see that? And a mountain will burst forth from the temple of Yah to water Acacia Valley. See the temple of Yah. Egypt will be destroyed. See, Egypt ain't going to be destroyed. I'm going to get more into that again. Edom too. See, you got Edom still standing too. Because of their violence, that's y'all that waking up. I thought it was my son waking up, sound like him. And so and the violence against Yah, I mean, see they got Jews, but the Yahudin, for they will kill innocent people. I mean, for they kill innocent people in those nations. But Yahshua yeah, y'all will prosper. See, so we're gonna prosper forever, continues, not never stopping. And Yah Shalom will be thrived as generation pass. See, we're going to thrive as generation pass. And I will not clear their oppressors of guilt. See, for my home is in Yah Shalom with my people. That is wonderful, brothers and sisters. That's enough to make you cry. I will when me and my family get together. But I got work to do. So I, I, don't, I don't have a lot of time to really focus and, and let this dwell in me like I used to. Because his work must be done. We ain't in that state yet. We got to get to this point. See, this thing going to be, it's not magic. Boom, we're going to jump from here to there. No, we got to move in and we got to obey y'all. We got to gather together. We got to gather together. A lot of things got to take place, brother and sister, which a lot is predicated on how we move towards y'all. Every word. So right here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end this in the prophet book, the prophetic vision again. In Zechariah, because Zechariah chapter 9. 
Give me a moment. Let me get there, brothers and sisters. Okay. Uh, right here. There's so much uh, information I need to give you. I'll be glad when we get together. I won't have to do this on Facebook and YouTube. I'll be glad when that day come. Once I, the knowledge increase of y'all people upon them. The Ruach overshadow you. Which is the knowledge of y'all. And you trim up the y'all words. Then you ready. Then I know you ready. Because you will, act, you will react. You will move to y'all words. You will know his Messiah is with you. Y'all see that. The branch. The breaker. The breach maker. You will know these things brothers and sisters. Who dwell among you. So right here, chapter 9 of Zechariah, uh, brothers and sisters, they call Zechariah. Chapter 9, verse 1, we get ready to it. It says, this is the message concerning Barah's curse on the lands of Hadrat, Damascus. For Yah is closely watching all mankind. You see that, brothers and sisters? Uh, Yah, he's not sleeping. Uh, he's not uh, sleeping or slipping at all. As well as Yahshua Yel Yah, his 12 tribes. You see that? Doom is Hamath near Damascus. And Tyre and Sidon too. Screw though they be. Though Tyre has armed herself to the hilt. And become so rich that silver is like dirt to her. And fine gold like dust in the streets. Yet Yah would dispossess her. And hurl her for the, I mean, fortification into the sea. See, they, 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 they thought it was uh, they protected places into the sea. They defense and saying she shall be set on fire and burnt to the ground. Many of all these things already took place. Ashkelon will see it occur and be filled with fear. Gaza will huddle in desperation, and Ekron will shake with terror, for their hopes that Tyree will. Was stop the enemy's advance will be dashed. God will be conquered. Her king killed. Ashkelon will be completely destroyed. Foreigners will take over the cities of Ashdod. You see that? And the rich cities of Philistine. Philist 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 I mean, you check the history. You see all these things took place in the foreigners that came in. You see, I will yank her idolatry out of her mouth. And pull from her teeth her her offerings that she eats with blood. Everyone, see uh, all the slaughterings and killing. Everyone left will worship Barah. See in that day, so everyone left uh, left alive will worship Yah, uh, Barah, and be adopted into Yahshua Yah -Yah as a new clan. See when all these things take place. So we got to know these things as well. The Philistines of Akron will intermarry with the Yahudim. See, they're going to intermarry with us, become one with us. Just as the Yebusites did so long ago. See, the Yebusites intertwine with us. So keep that in mind that Steve, the history we all got to know and learn, rehearse, and spread. It's saying, I will surround my temple like a god to see the turn of the third temple be built. I surround my temple like a god to keep invading armies from entering Yahshua Yel Yah. I am closely watching their movement. I will keep them away. No foreigner oppressor will again overrun my people's land when we return home. So right now we got we got foreigners over there overrunning our lands. Y'all gonna stop? This is gonna be shut down when we return home, brothers and sister. Watch. It said, Rejoice greatly, O my people. Shout with joy. For look, your king is coming. So now y'all right now and ran into Nelson. The king is coming. He is the righteous one. See, the one that bear the righteous rule of Yah. The victor. See, the one who's going to have victory. See, told you, the righteous one. See, oh, I got to stop meditating right there for a minute and expound on that. See, we get into the scripture. I'm showing you, out of all the people in our nation, it's one. Designated as the overall leader of our nation, not a multitude. Yes, we have a multitude of leaders, but not the one. These are the things you got to know, fan. Because brother is trying to convince me to follow them. How can the overall leader follow them? Unless the overall leader is blind as hell. 
Think about that, brothers and sisters. It's like uh, um, Esau, blind as hell, giving up his birthright. And then uh, and when the time to get blessed, now he realized the mistake he made. Zero with the leader, overall leader, brothers and sisters. See, I know this. Out of brothers trying to snatch this away from me. I'm not bragging on my ability by no means. I'm not proud of both of them just giving you the words of y'all. Right here. The overall leader, the Messiah got to know himself. You think the Messiah went uh, uh, correct another brother when, uh, when they're trying to step to him and tell him to follow him, follow them? Zero. Think about that, brothers and sisters. Only common sense will tell you the Messiah wouldn't do that. See, right here, say, uh, the king is coming. He is the righteous one, the victor, yet he is lowly. See? Lowly. Humble. Riding on a donkey cart. He said, I will disarm all the people of the earth. See, the time is coming when y'all going to disarm the people of the earth when the king comes. Point of, after that time period. But let's get into it. Including my people, Yasha, yeah, yeah. See, so Why you say including his people? Because the time, how you going to take a land back with no arms? When the other people got arms. Zero. It never took place that way in history, brothers and sisters. So keep that in mind. See, we now we're dealing with wisdom of y'all. See, and let me go back. He said, I will disarm all of my peoples. Excuse me, let me go back up. He said, I will disarm all peoples of the earth, including, see, my people, the 12 tribes, y'all should yell, y'all, and he shall bring peace, see. See, the Messiah right here, the victor, is going to bring peace when everybody be disarmed. See that? Think about that, brother and sister. From sea to sea. So, excuse me, I read, I miss something. He shall bring peace among the nations. See, he's going to bring peace among the nations. His realm should stretch from sea to sea, from river to the ends of the earth. He said, I deliver you from death into the waterless pit, in a waterless pit, because of the covenant I made with you. He talking to his 12 tribes, his people, sealed with blood. He said, come to the place of safety. Everybody should know, and you've been reading your word, the place of safety is Zion. All you prisoners, for there is yet hope, see, expectation of deliverance, salvation. I promise right now. I will repay you twice mercy for each of your woes. See, for of our troubles, he gonna pray uh, uh, twice as mercy. He gonna be twice merciful to us. See y'all, see y'all, you are my boat. See that nation of y'all. He said, "You are my boat, Ephraim." See, the y'all consists of the, uh, the southern nation. Ephraim was um of uh, 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 Yasef's seed, but the head of the um the northern tribes. Keep that in mind. You are my arrow. Both of you will be my sword. See, weapon of war. Like the sword of a mighty soldier. Brandish against the sons of Greece. Remember the Greeks the one sold us into captivity, brothers and sisters. See that? The, who, who got claim of our land today? So keep that in mind. See, it's showing you our battle of our, our nation. So keep that in mind. Make sure I ain't skipping none. Nothing. I didn't. Okay. I'm about to end this off. It said right here. Y'all should lead his people as they fight. See that? Self-explanatory. Only a fool will say something contrary to this. Which many have. I, I hear it. And many going to keep on saying it. Because they got a Christian mindset. A, 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 a fearful heart. They, they don't fear the words of y'all. But they walk and remember y'all said. You walk in your own ways. That's sin already brothers and sisters. A tribute to you, and you're gonna be destroyed from the face of the earth on that day. It's a Yah shall lead his people as they fight his arrows. Remember who the arrows the arrows are. Let's go back here. His arrow. Let me get it. Ephraim, you are my arrow. See. Let me get my place. Yah shall lead his people as they fight. His arrows shall fly like lightning, see, which is in attack mode. And Yah, the Rah, shall sound a trumpet call 
go out against his enemies. You see that? Like the whirlwind. The sons of Greece. Off the desert from the south. I'm not going to get into that. I, you know, I ain't giving every strategy of y'all uh, over the airways like that. See, it's much more. See, y'all got, uh, uh, y'all is the most wisest one. Nobody can, can encounter the strategy of y'all. So keep that in mind, brothers and sisters. He will defend his people, see? And they will subdue their enemies. See, y'all is our protector. He going to defend us. But we fighting. But he defended us. Because we acting off the words of Yah. Always remember that, brothers and sisters. He's right here. He will defend his people. And they should subdue. See, he said, we're going to do, which take under, capture their enemies, brothers and sisters. Trading them beneath their feet. You see that? They will taste victory, see? And shall triumph them. And they will slaughter their foes, leaving horrible carnage everywhere. I should end all right there. And Yah, Deborah, will save his people in that day. See, in that day, brothers and sisters, we're going to be saved. We ain't been saved now. We ain't been saved. 2,000 years ago, this man came on a tree, hung on a tree, and he saved us. He buried our, 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 our iniquities, our sin. That's full of shit. Falsehood. Brothers and sisters, the time y'all said we're going to be saved after we obey y'all and suppress the sons of Greece in our land. With that, I say, Toda Yah.